Hey guys, this is Chris. Uh, this is the 2011 FJ Cruiser. The uh, tire pressure light was on when we first got it, but uh, good news, we just got it fixed. Needed a tire pressure sensor uh, replaced and reprogrammed, so we got that done. We'll go ahead and do a start video. That's the tire light right there. All right, so now the tire light's gone. So yeah, we just replaced uh, tire pressure sensor on the uh, passenger side rear wheel and then uh, reprogrammed all four of them to the ECU with our little uh, tool and uh, that fixed it. So good news for that. Go ahead and take it for a little uh, test drive. This FJ Cruiser is uh, it's really clean, it really is. Uh, the paint is perfect shape. And uh, no lights on the dash. Everything is working as it should. Parking sensors, um, your power outlet in the, uh, in the trunk, uh, your A-Track mode, your USB port and your aux port right there, rear differential lock. Uh, and then you got your 4x4. Um, I really like these FJ Cruisers. They got these big uh, controls for your air conditioning. So if you're wearing gloves, you can easily control the heat and the air. So obviously you're going to be going off-road. Although I think the last owner who had this probably never even took it off-road. Uh, my guess. One owner probably had a garage kept just because the uh, it's such in, it's such in great shape. Uh, especially the paint and interior, everything really. Uh, heat is uh, really uh, nice. Air conditioning is ice cold. Sound system is fine. You got these cool uh, gauges up here. Your compass, temperature, little roll roll gauge. Um, so backup camera, uh, which only I think came out in like 2011, maybe the year before. But little backup camera right there. So put it in reverse. backup camera which is cool the earlier models didn't have that and then to put it in uh, four-wheel drive it's easy you just uh, put it in neutral and then you just put that down now you're in uh, high four okay you can go into low four put it back in the neutral put it into low four put it in the drive now you're in uh, low four, you can really feel it. So there's a little, a little bit of uh, dirt pile over here we can climb over, which will be fun. In the uh, four by four. Yep.
that's the uh, four low. So if I want to take it out of four low, just uh, put it back into neutral. Now I'm in H4, just goes the uh, four by four light on. Now I can just put it back into two by four. There, light goes away. So now we're in two by four. And if you really want to lock it, you can press that uh, rear diff lock. And if you're really stuck, press that and uh, you get out of anything. all the off-roading it's had in its life I guess also went ahead and replaced all the uh, light bulbs with LEDs so uh, got uh, LEDs oh got to turn the lights on but LEDs in the uh, front Replaced these as well with LEDs Well, I guess they're on, it's just so bright, but outside. But yeah, these are all LEDs right here. LEDs, and uh, also replace these with, with LEDs as well. So it's extra br extra bright at night. Got the Hancock uh, Dyno Pro tires, which look great. License plate uh, lights. Also LEDs. And when we, uh, I took the uh, cover off because when we reprogrammed the tire sensors, there's also a tire sensor uh, right here. So you have to reprogram all five. So I'll, I'll put it back on. Brand new spare in the back. So uh, when we got this truck, it didn't really need much. It was in, uh, it was in really good shape. No paint work or body work or anything like that was done to it paints all original uh, the only thing we did was uh, change the oil change the air filter oil filter we do that pretty much on every every car that we get and um, we also did a uh, full brake job on it so uh, all the way around so it's got uh, my seatbelt on second So we, um, we, we did brake, brake job all the way around. So it's got front, uh, and front and rear brake rotors and pads, brand new. Also calipers are brand new. So, uh, completely new brakes, brake job. So this, uh, this FJ is ready to go. You can pick it up. We're here in Western Maryland. Uh, it's a beautiful area out here. If you want to come and uh, pick it up, where there's three airports that are that are uh, the DC in the DC area. So Reagan, Dulles, and Baltimore. Or if you're really rich, you can fly directly into Hagerstown, but it's a small small airport, so probably very expensive. And then we're about an hour away from those major airports. And uh, yeah, it's a great, great uh, FJ. You could drive it across the country, no problem. So uh, make a uh, winter trip out of it.
heat off. So we literally just uh, just changed the sensor and reprogrammed it like right before making this video. So we'll go ahead and test drive it now for a few more minutes, make sure it doesn't come back on. Uh, but it shouldn't. These are cool. They got this compartment right here. It's like a map compartment or something. Which Pretty cool. Also, three wiper blades. Emergency brake. Is light ever going to change? All the windows work, including the uh, rear window popped open. Okay, going 60 miles an hour. Thanks for watching. Um, bid with confidence. This is a really is a great FJ Cruiser, one owner, clean Carfax, and um, brand new everything for brakes. Um, so bid with confidence. No lights on the dash. Everything works as it should, and it really is a uh, beautiful 
uh, has a beautiful paint job and uh, really nice color. It's a uh, quick sand. So thanks for watching and uh, good luck.